Number 11. Number 11. Now, this comes from, again, we're going all the way back to uh, very early in the calendar year. This is February 16th. Back to February. This is right around Valentine's Day. What oh, episode do you think this is? So this, romantic. This is episode 335. 335. This is probably the St. Valentine's Day massacre comedy style. <laughs> no. No? Of course, this is our special Valentine's Day episode. This is the wedding of Gilly and Gary. So it's pretty close. <laughs> 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 this was, of course, our our beloved PFT here. That's uh, right. Was in this episode as well as Gillian Jacobs and musician Colin Hay. That's right. Dropped by and participated. This was a very fun episode for me. I love uh, playing with uh, Gillian. She's hilarious, mm-hmm. and she's so much fun. She's People would know her from Community. Community and the Incredible Bird Wonderstone and, mm-hmm. and the upcoming Love. That's right, on Netflix. On Netflix with Paul Rust. That's right, Rust. We'll be talking about that in the new year. Can I tell you a quick story about Please Paul do. Rust? Yes. My uh, wife, Janie, and uh, our friend, Cynthia. Cynthia had a party at her home, mm. and Janie was there, and so was Paul's wife-to-be, Leslie. He was getting married soon. It was very soon. Mm-hmm. And Leslie said uh, to... Um, Janie and Cynthia, oh, you guys should come to our wedding. <laughs> and then we were not invited to the wedding. She's right. like, you should just come. Just come and by. Like, just well, drop in. Well, no, we don't want to, like, you know, whatever, crash your wedding and, you know, whatever. We know, like, because everybody was had been married. It's like, we know that that's, She was having a, a good a good time with you at this party and was like, yeah. I wasn't there. Oh, I wasn't there. there. This is no. just Janie. This is just Janie. JJ. J- 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 JJ Abrams. J. Jonah Janie. <laughs> My wife. <laughs> so... Leslie's saying, no, please come. It would make me so happy if I looked up and I saw you guys there. Please just come to the wedding. And so Janie's, Janie tells me this, like, we're going to go. And I'm like, uh, are you uh, sure Sounds about weird. This? Yes. And I really, I, I said, was she drunk when she said this? Like, no, she doesn't drink. Mm-hmm. She was totally sober. Right. She was very insistent, like, you guys should come to the wedding. Mm-hmm. I'm like, I don't know about this. And so it's like a month later and the wedding is happening. Mm-hmm. And so uh, they, they're they very excited. Janie and Cynthia and Cynthia's husband, Mike, like, let's do this. We're going to crash this wedding. Like, <laughs> okay, guys. Okay, let's do it. Yeah, so get all dressed this. up, meet at, at Mike and Cynthia's. And then on, on the way from our house to Mike and Cynthia's house, five-minute drive, uh, like, <laughs> like dread is mounting. Like, this is, we should Dripping not do this. Dripping sweat. We should not do this. Albert Brooks and Broadcast News. <laughs> exactly. I'm sitting on my jacket. <laughs> and so... I, I get into their house and I say, I'm really having second thoughts about this, mm-hmm. about doing this. And they're like, come on, it's going to be fine. It's going to be fine. We'll just go and we'll leave. Did, had anyone sent any kind of email reminder of like, hey, we're still going to crash your wedding or, or? Yeah, those guys had. Oh, okay. okay. No, no, so, not, no, 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 not no. to Leslie. No, not to Leslie. No, okay. no, no, okay. not at all. Just, just, <laughs> just to us. To each like, other. Can't like, can't wait to do this. Oh, boy. And so um, they say, come on, it'll be fun. We'll leave right after the ceremony so we're not, like, taking up any food or drink or whatever mm-hmm. at the at the reception. I'm like, okay. There's um, always leftover food and drink, though. No, I know, but it's, you know. Most it, of the time. But, it, but it's, if you, if you, if you have been married and you've, you've uh, thrown a wedding. And I, I pray that you are married. And, well, if point. you've invited more than 10 people, you mm-hmm. know that it's like, it's a pain, you know. Right. And it's like, it's not, a, it's not so much that Pains. it's a pain, but it's, it's. <laughs> Doing your impression. Pains. I swear to God, I was like, what is that? <laughs> so we we so they they convinced me, so we go to the wedding. And my ideally what would have happened was we would get there one minute before it started, right. watch the ceremony, and then and leave phew, immediately. So we get there. Leave a ball shaped hole in the wall. <laughs> exactly. And you can see by the outline of my body, I did not take any food or drinks. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Open no, hand. <laughs> Is that a hot dog? No, that's just, just his weird hand. A hot dog. Yeah, they had a carnival themed wedding. <laughs> um, so. We get there, and of course, the wedding is not starting on time because no wedding starts on time. Sure, either except for one. Who's Sarah Altman? 
Oh, that's right. <laughs> we pulled up our friend as they were walking out. Ner- nerd per- poker cast member Sarah Gazzardo. Oh my goodness! Her wedding started exactly, exactly on, on time. time. We and we got there at uh, say it started at six. We got there at six seventeen, yeah. and they were bum, 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 bum. they were coming out of the. I oh was the God. officiant of that wedding, oh and boy. I saw you guys. <laughs> and we we got there, and they're walking out, and and we're like going up to the valet, and Kulap's like drive. <laughs> I'm like, what, what? She's like, floor it, mister. All of a sudden, I'm the wheel man. <laughs> and so I had to drive around the block, and she's like, just keep driving around the block until like they go back in, and they can't see that we got there late. And, and they, they took pictures and for And they took pictures like an for hour. hour, and Kulab was just like, there's no way around it. We're going to have to. And she was, uh, she seemed fine with it. Yeah, who cares? Yeah. Um, so we get to, the, we get to the, the, the place where the wedding is going to be, and it's – I I'm so undisclosed location. We don't want any of you fucking weirdos <laughs> right. going around sniffing the seats. That's right. <laughs> so we get there, and of course, because I know Paul, mm-hmm. I don't know him well enough to be invited to his wedding, but I know him, and so. And do you know? Do you have any idea if he knows that you were asked to crash? No, I have okay. no idea. I have yeah. no idea. Oh, no one has like been in touch with Leslie at all. Situation. So I get there, and of course, there's a million people that I know from just around, right. you know? And I feel so self-conscious because I feel like everyone's looking at me like, I don't, I didn't think Paul knew weirdly, Paul that well. Weirdly, you and I never crossed paths during it. I kept going, where's Paul? Maybe, were you avoiding me because you didn't want to? No, I just, I, I saw I, you, I saw you walk in. I was like, oh, I got to make my way over to Paul and I never got over to you. We, here's why, mm-hmm. because we could not stay still. We kept moving around. We we're just trying. Like nervous energy. Yes, yeah. because, and now this was great. Now they're all nervous too. Like as right. soon as we got there, we're like, yeah, guys, this was a terrible idea. Right. And we're all very uncomfortable. And so the the at the one point the wedding is is getting ready to start and so we go kind of sit in the back and mm-hmm. then um an usher somebody you know from their party comes over and says oh no we we want uh, people to sit closer uh, I'm like no no do you we, do not we get up and we go hide and now I had shot stuff there in the this sheriff? venue yeah I shot the sheriff there <laughs> what about the deputy no the de- that was a different show oh okay um and so uh, I said let's you let's shot go. she's the sheriff there yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Look We've talked up. about this yeah, of course. many times. Many times. I sh- <laughs> I'll give you that one. <laughs> so, so I say, let's go downstairs. There's a bar downstairs. Let's go check out the bar because I used to film mm-hmm. Speakeasy there. Right. Oh, really? So, that, uh, not yeah. when I did it, but uh, okay. no, 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 no. Interesting. The bulk of Speakeasy we shot at this at right. this bar. And so we went downstairs and we're like kind of looking around, and then we emerge from this little room. And we see Neil Campbell, best man Neil Campbell, mm-hmm. who gives me a look of absolutely surprise. Of like, I don't think so. Really? I I, I don't know. I can't, I can't judge it. I'll, ch- I'll check in it. with him about it. Then we turn around. Then when Neil like looks past us and we turn around, we see the groom, oh. Paul Russ. Walking, like, and there's no. And he looks at us so briefly. Uh-huh. And in my mind, it was a look of what the fuck are you I doing here? Doubt you didn't want to be a distraction. I'm I, sure. I'm sure he has way more things. He, on way his more mind. like he's, like, you he's know. not even seeing a face. No, you know no. He's mean? just like, am I gonna yeah. cry? Am I gonna yeah, cry? He's am out I of gonna his cry? Mind. <laughs> he's out of his yeah. mind. Yeah. So, but it felt it felt horrible. It felt horrible. Uh-huh. And so. We're, so the the wedding begins, and so we're da, sitting, da, we're like, da, 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 et cetera, et cetera. The, Paul enters his with his with his mom and dad. Very mm-hmm. sweet. Mm-hmm. They kiss him and leave him at the altar. Leslie enters with her family. My wife and I stand up. Right. No one else in the entirety of yeah. this of this. And by the way, I saw you tweet about how you know. Uh, it, you're the only one who knows that it's polite to stand when the bride comes in. That was the second wedding I'd been to that week. In neither, uh, t- no, one, no one did. It was us I think and one a, other person. I think it's a new thing or something where people don't stand. And I, I, but how does everyone know? I don't know. I think no one wants to do it. Maybe. <laughs> and so if if no one is going to, but I also think that there are certain people who lead that kind of thing. Like, oh, is this one of these ones where we stand? Guess who it was not? It was not us. <laughs> right. <laughs> well, no you one, were in the back. No one, we were in the back. If you had but been you, in the front, everyone you know would have done it. Who, someone who was close to the front, who was the only other person that stood, was Michael Showalter. <laughs> <laughs> was the only person. And he Friend and he and my show. wife, he and my wife made eye contact, like shrugging shoulders, like, what is, why are right. people not getting up? And we stood for the whole the whole long entrance yeah. of Leslie to the altar, and then I, we sat down. I thought about it, and I was just like, why does anyone, who cares if anyone stands? 
I was happy to sit. I'm I'm fine with who cares if anyone stands, but mm -hmm. I just didn't understand. You want to know? How does everyone know? I don't this? know. I couldn't figure. But because I had just been to a wedding five days earlier or so that no one did, and there was no expectation because it was an unconventional wedding. I think right. I, was, I was in that headspace right. where I was like, "You don't." I, I did, but I've been to uh, this. This is the year that I went to. I believe nine weddings or wow, something. Wow, like wow! And at every other one, we all stood. So yeah. I don't know what happened in the brain for that particular week where people are just like, "Fuck this!" I don't. And I've been the officiant at a handful of weddings now. Mm -hmm. I've never had to tell people, and now please stand for right. the bride. People just did it. People just do it. People well, I just think did it. I think there is usually if they want it there's usually someone who initiates yeah as in hey we're all saying but you know what is worse and i made sure i was the officiant at a wedding this year myself uh what is worse is i've been to a wedding recently where no one said please be seated and people <laughs> had to stand what for for a lot of the wedding it was so. So I, they didn't get like okay when they're set, you can just sit down. Well, yeah, yeah, because the person just launched into the thing the minute like the bride went there, and everyone's standing, and no one wants to interrupt. Right, right. right. It was really bad. <laughs>